Alright guys, another adventure today, but Don't this time, Beach. yeah, where are we going? Coney Beach. Yeah, we're going to go to Coney Beach today. That is one of the smaller theme parks in South Wales. It's actually a fairground, right? It's sort of a fairground, but sort of a theme park. It's kind of confusing. Yeah, it's, it's kind of like a theme park stroke fairground, and it's right next to the beach in South Wales, uh, down at Porth Coal. So we're going to go and pay that a visit today. We've already done the likes of Oakwood and Folly Farm and recently yes. we went to Winter Wonderland. Yeah, soon we're going to go to Oakwood. As soon as we can, we're going to go to Oakwood and yeah. maybe I'll go to Sweden. Uh, okay. So yeah, we're about to catch the train and we'll catch up with you later. Bye. Are you excited? So much! Mm. There's the train! It does pause as uh, put it a black screen and then it connects to the other part. Yes, that's how it works on YouTube. <laughs> Hi guys! We just got off the bus. We managed to get a train from where we live, which is in Neath, to Pyle and we got a bus all the way down to Coney Beach. Was it Porthcourt? Yeah. Porthcourt, sorry. And we just arrived, we can see the rides in the distance. Dylan is getting very excited, aren't you? I'm very scared because I just saw Beach Party and it's like an adult bigger than a building. Yeah, it's, it's so huge. So we're gonna see how it goes now and we shall update you once we're inside. All the best. So guys, we've arrived at Coney Beach. And here it is, here's all the different rides. There's Fantasia in the distance. There's Fantasia. We saw that on Theme Parks Worldwide blog. Yeah, so uh, there's that ghost train that Dylan is extremely excited to go on. Yep, yeah. So. I'm here to have a very loud klaxon. Oh yeah, it's a very loud klaxon apparently. Uh, that's according to Sean on Theme Parks Worldwide, isn't it? So we're going to yeah. check that out. Oh look, a little kiddies ride here. Yep, a little gold yes. Got our wristbands. Awesome. Right. Awesome guys. Okay. I Let's get to I it. I don't know why you have been shown on Team Park World Ride say they're so violently that they make you wear <laughs> Yeah. You've been on a number of waltzes in the past, haven't you? <laughs> this one isn't about energy, it's about sunza, which, can, which are actually very similar. Yeah. But luckily, these seats don't detach. Oh, yeah. These are the same and some that don't want to. Yeah. Oh God, that waltzer ride was the most extreme waltzer ride that we've ever been on. What did you think of it? I, my legs want to fall from my body right now. <laughs> Basically, when we went to Swansea, the waltzers, the, the guy on there was a bit lazy and he wasn't really pushing us. On these ones, they were very attentive as well. You know, they were asking, is he okay, is he okay? You know, but um, on these ones, they were extremely fast and they were pushing us like crazy. I really loved it. Dylan, a little bit woozy, but I think he enjoyed it as well. Yeah. Now we're gonna try this, this out. Look at this. This is Frankenstein. Is that a scary dude or what? You definitely seen some better days. <laughs> He's definitely seen some better days. All right then, here we go. Oh, here we go. <laughs> Do you like it or is it too creepy? <laughs> What's that? Here we go. Oh my god. He's a bit creepy. Get ready for the claxon, right? It's gonna go like that. These are nice. 
I like the theming. Do you? Right, get ready, it's gonna go out of nowhere, okay? Oh my god! Thank you very much, I'm deaf for the rest of my life. Yeah, Sean was right about that, wasn't he? What about those creepy noises? Can you hear them? There's lots more stuff in this ghost thing, isn't there? Look at that leg, it removed. So, we just came off the ghost train. Dylan has a little bit of a review for you. Scare factor. Scare factor what? Extreme? <laughs> it was extremely scary. How does it compare to the Grinch? About one quadrillion times scarier. About one quadrillion times scarier than the Grinch, according to Dylan. Um, they took off the room in my, my view is that it was excellent. It was uh, there was loads of different features. There was different theming on there compared to the Grinch Ghost Train. The Grinch has about five different parts, which are scary. I had about twenty, so very good. And the klaxon was extremely loud. So off to our next ride. I'm not sure which one we're gonna go on. I think Dylan's a bit overwhelmed with the extremeness of these rides. You thought they were gonna be very easy. Yeah, I thought it was gonna be like one to one to land. <laughs> these are a bit more thrilling. Yep. Maybe we'll go on this one. Go back to the toddler days. <laughs> no. No, let's crank it up a notch. Let's crank it up a notch, he says. Let's crank it up a notch. We're going on the scissors. Okay. <laughs> Dylan is trying one of the less scary rides. Huh? Dylan! So yeah, we're gonna check out this park. I mean, Dylan, he's eight years old. He is brave, very brave for his age. Um, and I turn this around. You're tall enough to go on here. Well, you remember when? That. Remember when we went to Oakwood? You were 1.24 meters, so you've probably grown a little bit by now. I know, but I just recognise it. Yeah. Uh, Sorry. I just recognise it more because the car. I don't see the car. Ah, it's fine, man. It's, it's really not very thrilling at all. Come on, we'll be fine, okay? So a little update. We went on Paratrooper and it was great. Dylan was a little bit scared about the heights, but now we're about to go on Nessie, the roller coaster, aren't we, Dylan? We're enjoying ourselves so far. Yo! It's gonna start speeding up. Some of you 
want to say. This ride, we do not recommend this ride. <laughs> As you see, that boy's struggling there. That is the same. <laughs> Yeah, better are used on different rides like Fantasia, like Dylan said. I mean, that ride over there, you just get stuck in it every two seconds. And I, I can already tell that our legs are going to be in agony tomorrow just from push it, trying to push ourselves off it. I know. Uh, never mind, On to, onwards to different rides. We're going to try the waltzes again, I think. Evans Thunderdome. I like this part, the arm that moves. Oh, what a trip that was. We had a great time at Coney Beach. Dylan also had a great time, didn't you? I, we just went back to ski wind, so I'm, yeah. I'm all thrilled up. <laughs> You're all thrilled up. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we had a great time. So uh, we apologise about filming in the dark. It's just uh, things got a bit hectic towards the end, and um, hectic, you know. We were a bit busy, and we had to rush to go and get the last bus and the last train home. Yep. Um, we Bye. appreciate it to the Bye. few viewers that we have so far. Bye. We're going to make this a more professional operation in the future, Bye. and. We went on the waltzers again about yeah. three times. Somebody, <laughs> somebody chucked lump. Uh, what do you say? <laughs> what do you call it? They chucked. They threw up uh, on the waltzers, unfortunately. So that was a bit disgusting. But we weren't on the ride. We just witnessed the man standing outside the ride with sick all over himself. Yeah. Um, so apart from that. Yeah, just an amazing time. Dylan went on the ghost train probably about 15 times. Yeah. Made friends with the man who was on the ghost train, as usual. He, he, everywhere we go, Dylan makes friends with the ride, the ride assistants. Anyway, so in the coming year, we are planning to go to... Why did you say uh, that like that? Coming year? I don't know. <laughs> We plan to go to Oakwood again. We've already been to Oakwood, it's just we weren't um, filming YouTube yeah. videos back then, were we? Yeah, that was when our channel was called Do Not Read My Profile Picture. Yeah, but now it's Stone's World of Adventure. Yeah, please subscribe <laughs> and like our video. Um, yes, so we plan to visit Oakwood, maybe Folly Farm. I would like to visit Chesterton World of Adventures because we often go to London to see our auntie. Yeah, um, maybe when it's December, go to Hyde Park, but I can't guarantee Yeah, it, Dylan would like to go to Hyde Park, Winter Wonderland as well, because there's a lot of rides there. Yeah, it's like too long But realistically, we'll probably end up going to Coney Beach many times and yeah. find having, having a go of some of the rides that we didn't get to go on, because we're, we can take advantage of the wristbands, which was £20, but if you pay online, it's £18. So it's a saving of two pounds and also they've dropped the charge which they used to have they used to charge spectators uh two pounds to just walk around the park basically but they've dropped that this year so if you want to take your kids down it would be free this is not an advertisement and plus, we're not a big enough channel to get advertisements and plus um, sponsorship and plus on fantasia if you're hoping to get into that indoor section at the back of Fantasia, they removed it, snow point, they removed the snow as well. Yeah, but it was still awesome. Anyway, so yeah, it costs £18 for the ultimate wristband. Actually, it's the only wristband. Yeah. They've actually scrapped the, the system they had before was toddlers only £12, and then they had one, a standard wristband, which was 15 and the ultimate, which was 18 Now, it's just the ultimate and it's 18 if you order online. So, anyway guys, it's getting so dark that you can't see us anymore. Yep. So we're gonna say sayonara, see you later. Okay. Adios. And make sure you subscribe, otherwise on your next trip, I will be there on our next trip. 